Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the next two weeks, Google will be rolling out version 116 of Chrome. So starting next week, the 8th or the 9th, we will get the early stable. And then the following week, the 15th or the 16th, Google will push out version 116 to the general public officially. Now, starting with version 116, Google has said that we one of the new features that is going to be rolling out and with a gradual rollout from version 116, they say they will be adding the allow this time option to the permission prompt. So basically, it's a one-time permission prompt that you will now see starting in version 116, which Google says will make it easier for you to use powerful web capabilities when it comes to your privacy, obviously, when visiting certain websites that are asking for different permissions. Now, Google carries on to say from this announcement that allow this time will initially be available on desktop for some of the most common permissions. And if we just head over to a demo site, those most common permissions, as many of you may know, are geolocation, camera, and microphone. Now, they carry on to say that these permission prompts for other capabilities and on the mobile web are unchanged for now, but may change in the future. Now, just to cut to the chase and just to show you more or less what this new feature is all about. Currently, in the stable version of Google Chrome, which is currently sitting on version 115, as an example, if I head to a website and it needs microphone permissions, this is what we will see. So it says permission dot site wants to use your microphone and then you can click on allow or block that site or you can X out. Now that's how it currently works in the stable version. Now although this feature, this new allow this time is not available in the stable version, in Chrome Canary version 117, we can enable an experimental flag which will give us um, a good idea is more or less what to expect when this feature does roll out. And this flag can be enabled in Chrome 116, which is currently in beta, or any newer version right up to Chrome version 117, which is, as mentioned, the latest preview version. So as always, to enable experimental flags, we head to the address bar, we enter Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags. And in the search, as many of you will know by now, the easiest way to bring up the flag is just to type in a keyword. So... I'm just going to type in one time, and there we go, one time permission. That's the flag, and the description reads, enables experimental one-time permissions for geolocation, microphone, and camera, as mentioned. So in Chrome version 116 or newer, we change that from default to enabled, and we'll have to relaunch a Chrome version 117 to apply that flag. Now, if we head back, to the same demo site and I click as an example on camera and microphone you will see now or let me try another one microphone you will see now that permission.site wants to use your microphone so now as mentioned and um, we are now presented with four options so we are presented at first with allow this time which will temporarily allow you obviously um, that site to use your microphone then allow on every site is the next option that's a persistent allow so obviously you will allow that will um when every time you visit that site um it will have the permission to use your microphone and then obviously don't allow that will block that site from using your microphone as an example in this case and then you can x out and obviously that will temporarily block that site so those are the the, the four new permissions allow this time allow every uh, visit don't allow and then obviously you can x out and that, as mentioned, is now being tested in um, Google Chrome version 116 and newer. And that's the new Allow This Time, which is going to be rolling out over the next two weeks as a new feature, um, which will be an option with the permission prompts um, giving one-time permissions in Google Chrome version 116. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.